Hi, welcome back to the House of Da Vinci 3, where last episode we apparently needed to get this random piece of wood that was lying there. Um, and I'm assuming we now have to find out where we need to put down that same piece of wood. While I would imagine it was would be here, it is not. <clears throat> you could put it under here and... Oh wait, can we just not use... Crane to lift it? That would be. That would make sense, right? Now that the bag's gone. Have to wait for me to. T oh. Much safer, a loose piece of. Oh, this game. So you can grab that from a note. So that's a support for something. Uh, I think I can leave. I'm gonna put the crane back where I found it. So. That will be here. Because you know there's a good chance we're going to have to hook that back, right? We just have to find our way to it. <clears throat> well, assume we don't just plop that in there, yeah. Um, so what is this? Arcubus. Oh. Looks more like an awkward spear to me, but... I think it's why it's swimming along submerged javelins. I need to deal with the situation by other means. Yes, like try and find out how to get to there. And I don't suppose hanging from the crane is an option. I think I now have everything to repair the broken trough in the upper part of the pit, but I don't think I can get there from the pit itself. So 
So you're telling me we need to presumably lift the bag up again. Are we able to fix it from here? No, because it won't let us... ...near it. I completely missed this. I am oblivious. Main reason why I probably shouldn't be playing these when I'm tired. And again, what would be a good game to play when tired, right? Something high on the reflex is probably a bad idea as well. Hmm. What if I could hang the back from probably not, right? All right, let's go see. What happens when we fill up number two? And number one. So all that to grab another bag. So do I need these back? I think I'll need the shaft again, I should leave. Okay. So we get a second which I guess we're gonna use as a wrecking ball because this is looking kind of shady Oh, 
I won't lie to you. This was quite shocking. <laughs> definitely not coming back this way. But that doesn't matter. We need to continue forward. The rail can be used as a ladder. After you, Giacomo. Of course, just in case it can be used as a ladder on a fault of face. Now this is what I call the masonry. In the elevator, Nerd. given its age, the technology is very advanced. I'm sure it leads directly to Castle Del Monte. The mechanism looks quite reliable. I think it could be repaired. By me, I assume. Giacomo. I would need a step ladder or a stool. I'm afraid that it is too high for me. Would you be so kind? Just stack some bricks. So I know from what I've remember for um, European Universal is that the double keys are a sign of the Pope stuff, right? That relates to the <laughs> Don't mind if I do. And we know this signifies the order, so this is kind of the moment where order fights Pope. Well, there's a stool. Seriously, just grab a brick, put it somewhere, and then pick another brick. Uh, I wanted the middle, don't I? Yeah, well, I'm gonna need to. Uh, Liberate somebody. F like, I don't want the cart. Do I want the cart to go? I want the cart to go straight because then I can stand on top of it and take the stool. Uh, maybe it's actually in the proper position now that I've moved that. I Well, this is one of the to present the fact that the rats are right here was a reason maybe I did something I believe they're after what is on the cart. So I'm gonna have to fix... This ain't doing enough. I need to put in a bent piece of rail that the one guy is holding. I 
Because these won't do, right? Why would they? Who's walk through among the rodents? Um. So what happens if I send the car to the left? And what would it take for me to find a piece of rail? I'm probably after this, right? But Jimmy here is holding on to dear life. Okay, let's see where that cart is now. There's the bent piece of rail, which we can now unbend. Mm, that's a weird orientation for that, but... We can go. Yeah, but I know this time we really could have made quite the wall with just the loose bricks lying around. Just gonna throw that out there, you know. Uh, also, now that we have the key, can we use the key to just. Nope, seems like you're a little occupied. Um, yeah. Here you go, buddy. think you could get me a shaft like this one but straight or just find a way to straighten this one out I have just the thing <laughs> smash Still bent rod. Here you go, buddy. It seems the mechanism is fine, but the cogs are a bit rusty. Could you also get me some oil? Ugh. 
See even looks full of oil. Why do we need this? Tea. Um, you got anything to put the oil in? No. Um, oh. thought maybe we could have used the rags somehow, but no. So we need a container for the oil. Um, uh, where does the card end up if we send it to the right again? Somewhere there, wasn't it? Shouldn't this piece of rail still be here? Okay, who here has a pot? Can I use a helmet? this end up if it goes that way seriously how would you know that you Are we just taking the entire thing off the wall? Alright. Looking to pass at a moment when the Pope's army attacked through the secret passage. The situation seemed chaotic, but Paul II did not underestimate the preparation as required. The soldiers were well-trained and effectively moved towards the elevator and the room, which links Castle Le Monte with the passage. I think Leonardo and I will have to use it too. Glad Leonardo came with me. Nothing like having an old friend in the lines then. Besides, the uncanny ability to understand all sorts of mechanisms regardless of their purpose and age came in very handy. I don't think anyone else could have fixed the elevator. At least not nearly as fast. Thank you for the help, Giacomo. Now all you need to do is get in here and turn that wheel over there. Because my go arm is it. not that long. Our goal is in sight. Well, before we do that, I think I am going to cut it here. We'll see what's uh, all the way up there to start the next episode. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the series. We'll see you guys on the next one. Bye, everyone.